Hi Gemini, welcome to my channel. This is Chelsea. Thank you so much for liking and subscribing. I really appreciate your love and support. Hope all is well with everyone. And Gemini, please bear in mind that this reading will not resonate with each and every one of you. And today we are going to find out what are your important love messages. And this reading has a bonus extended. The link is in the description box below. Spirits and angels, please show me important accurate love messages for Gemini today. You hear some noise in the background. It's my, it's my kettle. <laughs> when I do my reading, I need to drink a lot of water. Gemini, important love messages for Gemini spirit. Is Sherman more? Okay, Gemini, please bear in mind that roles can be reversed in this reading. Could either be you or your person you are thinking about or dealing with. Ten of Swords is here, Gemini. So it looks like a lot of you may be going through a separation right now or feeling a lot of pain. Um, oh, again, roles can be reversed here, definitely indicating an ending. Well, we've also got the Queen of Swords in reverse, so it does indicate somebody who could be resenting somebody over something that has happened, okay? Resentments or holding grudges, all right? Towards, for some of you, maybe it has something to do with a new beginning, or somebody may have actually started a new relationship elsewhere, okay? But this may also mean that somebody is not telling you or you're not telling them in regards to wanting to... Uh, renew this love okay this aces could indicate a new beginning uh, you got a king and queen both are in reverse here okay so this is uh, this is actually your energy Gemini uh, Libra Aquarius if this is you and your person doesn't matter king or queen okay it's not gender specific but I may look like both of you are not speaking to each other right now or somebody is not speaking the truth or it could also mean that both of you are not physically intimate right now okay so definitely going through some issues right now but i feel like with the hermit in reverse could indicate somebody mm, coming out of their hermit mode okay realizing that perhaps you are their one and only true love or it could go vice versa okay maybe they're really realizing that about you or you're realizing that about them and we've got the page of wands here, Gemini. This indicates somebody may be wanting to send you a message, okay? Passionate message or extending an olive branch here. Or for some of you, Gemini, there could be somebody new, okay? This could be a new beginning in love for some of you with a fire sign, Aries, Sagittarius, Leo. Yeah. So we've got the Knight of Swords here. This indicates something, somebody is in a hurry, okay? It looks like somebody uh, may want to speak, but uh, a knight of swords can be very impulsive with the way they they uh, talk, okay? They may not quite filter their words, but if it's not about talking communi or communicating, it could just mean a very fast energy coming in here, or someone may be upset as well in the past. In regards to somebody with the page of cups here in reverse, Maybe someone is angry because they thought this person was genuine but turned out to be not. But also, I don't know why, the pages here to me indicate some childishness or immaturity, okay? Somebody may be immature here in regards to the, to the way they speak, to the way they handle things, okay? And we got the cherry here reversed. This indicates a stop. It's To me, it's like, okay, stop. <laughs> No more. I'm not going to move forward anymore um, because Six of Cups in reverse because somebody may be giving somebody really bad memories in regards of something in the past here, okay? And Ten of Swords, very, very painful card. You can see that, right? All the swords are on this person's back. So we got the Six of Wands here. This definitely indicates somebody may be chasing after you or you're thinking about chasing somebody here, okay? With the Empress. For me, it's like like this, like this person is coming towards the Empress. Whether it's you or the Empress or your person is the Empress, but if the Empress is you, Gemini, I feel like somebody may be actually seeing you as the one that they want to be with long term, very beautiful, uh, very abundant, somebody they can see um, 
marrying if both of you are not married to each other um a marriage uh, marriage material <laughs> the empress here okay somebody that may see you or put you on a very high regard okay hmm well, it could be you feeling this way about somebody. A six of ones also to me indicates somebody maybe keeping their options open, starting to date other people, right? Um, I feel like it's going to be a very successful date. If you think about dating other people, Gemini, I feel like it's going to be very successful. You may have a lot of uh, people whom, are, whom admire you, okay? And the Six of Wands also indicates success, and of course, with the Empress here, could indicate, you know, uh, somebody actually really is interested because they see this person. Because the Empress is at the highest level of all, okay, in comparison to the Queen. So, someone may put you at a high regard, or it could go vice versa. But for some of you, Six of Wands could indicate someone trying to return from the past, but someone may be actually. Finally realizing their true value or worth and figure, you know, I can do better, okay? Could be you or your person, again, roles can be reversed. Let's see more. You may have been dealing with somebody, could be you or your person, but there's somebody very sneaky, okay? Can be deceptive, maybe a liar, okay? Um, all this could also mean somebody strategizing, okay? Trying to sneak their way back into your life or it could go vice versa. You know, the seven sources is a thievery card as well. Someone may have stolen something from you, okay? Or it could go vice versa, stolen your heart or literally uh, stolen something okay for some of you ace of wands is in reverse this indicates um hmm, either an offer being rejected a new offer being rejected offer of reconciliation or offer to reignite passion could have been rejected and i feel with the star here it's because somebody it may find it really hard to forgive somebody okay uh, going through some healing and recovery but still finding it really hard to completely recover but gemini we've got the world here so it looks like it could be a closing of a chapter and a start of a new chapter for a lot of you guys okay perhaps it could mean a new beginning in love with the ace of cups here but gemini we are going to clarify the world here let's see what is closing what is opening for you guys what is this all about? Could it be this person trying to return and ask for a, you know, a renewal, closing of an old chapter, and start a new chapter with you? Okay, start a new love beginning. And we're going to clarify the Ace of Cups here as well, okay? So in your extended reading, bonus extended reading, we're going to clarify the world, the Cups, Ace of Cups, and we're going to clarify the Seven of Swords here as well. Let's see, you know, what what is this person up to? Um does look like they may have some uh, hidden agenda or could be planning something here so we're gonna clarify seven of swords the world ace of cups and also I'd like to clarify the empress here okay let's see um because the empress may indicate for me marriage in the future or a commitment i feel like could sometimes indicate pregnancy as well but anyway gemini we will clarify one two three four of these cards here in the extended reading if you're uh if you're interested the link is in the description box below you can just click on it it'll take you straight to my patreon page but for this reading it's a bonus extended reading it's only for platinum members okay gemini uh, if i don't see you at the extender i hope to see you uh, back here on my youtube channel take care bye gemini